Hello, my name is Dr. Speaker Bloor. In this video, I'm talking about my synthesizer SB2. Uh, it's a semi-modular uh, architecture, so you have some things are patched already and some are not, and you can do it through the matrix window here. So let's start. You have monophonic or polyphonic modes. If monophonic, you can choose either free or hold note keyboard modes. Then you have pitch band control here. You can always see the values on, the, on, on this um, LCD display. Modulation will uh, speed, so the amount is controlled, of course, by the modulation wheel. And glide only works also in monophonic mode. This was the MIDI side. Here, the master control, you have stereo the tune on or off and it uh, amount wide. So how much wide you want the stereo field and the final level. You have two options on the circuitry, fat or ultra analog. And you have a back view where you can see the block diagram and inside the machine. Okay, so oscillators. Sterity tune means that each oscillator is doubled and then it's one for left, one for right. And the pitch, you set it here, but it will detune left and right sides with this control here. So, as an example, without, with, so you have three oscillators that you can disengage here with this uh, for classic uh, analog waveforms plus 24 exclusive waveforms by myself. Then you have octave, semi uh, tones and fine pitch controls, pan and final level for each oscillator. Three oscillators that are mixed here where you have this level for all of them then sub oscillator and noise control here you have the envelopes where you have the first one engaged already to the amplifier so this is the final level control and the other two are free so you have to use the matrix to set them in in this case i set envelope 2 to filter 2 cut off and envelope 3 to oscillator 1 pitch uh, and you have the controls, the amount here. Then uh, we have velocity control here where you can set it independently for amplifier, filter one or end uh, filter two. Filters, we have two filters here and the control for them here. So we have balance between filter one, filter two, routing if you want them in parallel or serial, and the drive if you want and the, how much you want and where it, where it is pre drive pre filters or post filters the drive is set in filter one so pre filter one or post filter one filters we have this type of filters here mad dog low pass 24 moog 20 uh, 12 db per octave low pass band pass high pass 12 dB per octave and high pass 24 dB per octave. Filter 2, we have low pass 24, low pass 12, high pass, band pass and notch filter 12 dB per octave. Cutoff, resonance, key, um, tracking and velocity on, bo on both controls. And um, you can also set... Um, filter controls here in the matrix and the modulators are these ones envelope one two or three lfo one two or three so lfos are here lfo one is uh, this one 
So you can design your own waves and then control them here with the smoothness. Turn them on on each one here and the rate for this small, uh, let's call it, sequencer. LFO, uh, they are all uh, sync, so they are not free. You always have um, beat measures uh, up there where you you can see that you can go from 132 to 32 bars on each one, except number one. As you can see, different. And here, the gator. So it's a um, trans gator where you can also set your small sequence here with smoothness control rate and uh, power if you want it on or off let's see So very musical section, this one. Here, the Matrix, I, I, I talked about it already, so let's use this one to use as an example. They are all the same, these nine cells. Uh, envelope 1, 2 or 3, LFO 1, 2 or 3, and destinations, you have pitch for oscillator 1, 2 or 3, are the three, pit, the three oscillators pitch uh, together here. Then amplifier here, the same, the, the, all of them here. Sub amplifier, noise, noise amplifier, and pen. Again, three oscillators pen here. Filter one, cut off or resonance. Filter two, cut off or resonance. You can also get both of them in one time here. Now, to finish multi effects section, you can turn it on or off here. You can use it as a uh, parallel to the sound of the synthesizer or serial as uh, uh, in the end of the chain of the sound. So you can then mix parallel here or set the amount of the serial here the same. Input here, so the sound of the synthesizer will arrive to this control here. Then three effects, A, B and C, they are all the same, so you have this this um, type of effect on each one. Um, I have to say that this section here is not automated, so you cannot get automation in your DAW for this section, but you can get it for the other main section. Uh, chorus and delay, delay and reverb, distorted chorus, flanger, quad distortion, stereo delay, tape delay, or reverb. These are the effects you can choose in this order. They are in serial, don't forget. So first is flanger, followed by distorted chorus, and the delay and reverb. These three effects together are set in parallel mode, so the sound of the synthesizer and the effects is uh, not mixed, and you can balance it here. Again, back section, do not open, you cannot touch inside, it's not good for your health. Touch only the front panel. Okay, so let's hear a bit of the sound. Thank you. 
So a great synthesizer for ambient sounds. So have fun. See you next time.